Oh my day, this is me in the dollar kitchen. Today's vlog mga Inday, I'm gonna tell you about my first attempt doon sa life in the UK at kung paano ako next study din kung ano ang site na pinupuntahan ko para doon ako mag-study ng ano yung yung pre-exam ay yung pre-exam test na doon ko magpa-practice and then yung first attempt ko guys ano yun, ano date yun Baka, I think it's two weeks ago two weeks ago yun na eh, ano ko, nagkamali ako kasi dapat yung ang ginagamit kong ID pala yung uh, lib uh, resident permit, residence permit guys. Pero ang na, family name ko doon, yung single pa ako. Ngayon kasi married na ako, nilagay ko yung sa pagbuko yung apelyido ng asawa ko. Tapos yung dinala ko doon sa site, yung ano nga, yung basta nagkamali ako paglagay. Dinala ko, nagkamali ako, dinala ko yung yung residence permit pero yung apelyado nung dalaga pa ako so ang nangyari hindi ako pina-exam at yung nadala ko ng nadala ko pala ng ano yung nadala ko sorry guys, nabulol yata ko so ang nadapa bisaya, okay ang nadala ko na ano, na papilis o yung mga papers nadala ko marriage contract pero mali din ako akala ko original, hindi pala So, hindi ako in hindi ako pina-exam. So, so, this is the second exam, guys. Today is Saturday. Uh, uh, today is Sunday. So, yung next exam ko is the 4th of May. So, tomorrow, last na study ko. Tapos, uh, Tuesday yung exam ko, guys. Tuesday ang exam ko. So, fingers crossed. I hope I'm gonna pass it. So, take note, guys. Kailangan kayo, kung magbubo kayo, yun din ang gagamitin nyo. Pangalan, family name, etc., etc. Hindi, huwag kayo magkamali. Basta yun ang kadalasang namalik ng mga nagbubok. Ng mga nagbubok ng exam. Sayang ang 50 pound na binayad ko. So, bayad ulit ako. So, I hope and I check again na yung family name ko, yung nasa ID ko, it's tama lahat. So, fingers crossed. Chinek ko na. Tama na siya. Lahat lahat tama na. So, hindi ka na magkadala ng ibang papilis ko yun ang dinala mo. Kung anong ID ang nilagay mo sa ano. Anong ID ang nilagay mo dun sa booking online yun ang nadalhin mo. Wala ka lang ibang dalhin. Okay guys, kasi yun ang sinasabi sa akin nang nasa uh, na nandun sa examination as yung nagbabantay dun o nag uh, ano nag exam. So, fingers crossed guys. So, ngayon ipapakita ako na sa iyo kung ano ang site na magandang puntahan at doon ka magpa-practice ng English ng life in the UK. So, ito yun, guys. So, ilagay mo lang yung life in the UK testweb at dot co dot uk So, yan siya. Tapos dito, makikita mo yan una ito. Yan, yan, yan. Makikita mo na. Yan, makikita mo yan siya una. So, ang nagawin mo dito ka sa exam, kahit hindi ka na mag, kahit hindi ka na magbabasa ng book, pero binasa ko yung book na natapos ko na siyang basahin. So, ito yun, exam, dito ka mag-study. So, ito na yun siya. Ito na yung makikita mo. Ito yung 16 na webs. 16. Yan, 16. 16 na parang parang blocks diyan tapos 24 each of them ang questions no oh, 24 
questions siya to 24 questions siya guys basta yan 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 ito yun kung basta dito ka pakita ko lang sa inyo no kasi para napakita ko na yan yan kailangan nyo lang silang basahin kailangan mo siyang basahin na maikit mga inday nakita nyo ba yan? nakita nyo ba Life in the UK that go alive in the UK, no space test with that go that UK. Tapos dito ka sa exam, practice ka exam. So ito yung makikita mo. 16 lang yan sila. You don't ka mag, don't ka mag study sa 16. Meron din siya makikita mo dito. Maraming. Pwede mo rin daw studyhan to hanggang 40. Tapos then, tapos to, na-practice ko na yan sila. So ito, ito yun siya. British citizen, paano nga yan sila. Yes, you know. So, ang kailangan mo siya. Pwede mo rin, mo rin siya tong i-ano, i-play. Kasi may audio din siya. Kung gusto mo, ayaw mo magbasa. Gusto mo rin, basahin mo talaga yan sila. Tapos, para alam mo yung answer, mayroon dito ang sabi niya to. Anong responsible mo? Life in the UK. So, yan. Kasi kadalasan ito daw ang lumalabas. So, I was wrong in there kasi hindi ko siya nakita. No? So, uh, pakita ko siya ulit sa inyo. No? Basta ito lang, number 24 ang i-play ko para hindi tayo masyadong tataas yung bibi natin. So, yan. Kailangan mo silang ano daw ang responsible mo if you are a pretty citizen. So, yan. Yan yun. Tapos, i-check. Pwede mo siya i-check dito kung kung correct ba. So, yan. Correct. Sabi niya, correct ka. Yan. Yan. Yan yun. Tapos, where is the Big Ben location? So, yung Big Ben location, guys, nasa House of the Parliament siya. So, yan. Yung clock ba na well known sa London. Yan, yan. So, ano yan siya? When women and men, a woman, when women and men are uh, giving right to vote is 1928. Yan, check marine. Ayan siya. Correct. Tapos, where is the you graphically located? Geographically. Northwest yan siya. Tapos check mo na naman. Take no time. Hindi ka pwedeng maganito sa real exam na iti-check mo. Hindi wala. Hindi ka maka. Kailangan mong basahin at alam mo ang answer. Kasi hindi ka pwedeng mag-check doon na correct. Kasi tuloy-tuloy yun. Pero pwede kang mag-ano. Kung hindi mo alam. Kailangan mo siyang E, post mo na. Tapos, babalikan mo siya. Just gonna so, ask. I'm just gonna ask, who are you? Uh, wait, wait, wait. And then, who is the patron of uh, uh, Scotland? So, I think St. George. St. St. Andrew. If he gets this wrong. So, St. Andrew is okay. George. Uh, wait, don't, don't trouble the... Don't move my body, please. Okay, sorry. I'm doing something here. So, which the two house of a uh, war of roses? So, let's see. Yan siya. And two. So, kailangan mo maghanap ng dalawang class answer. So, yan. So, kailangan mo siyang basahin din yung book para maalam mo. 
ito, hindi ito mali yan, mali. So, kasi 1989 yan, hindi 16. So, pause yan, guys. Ngayon, pupunta tayo dito sa number 8 question. So, uh, what is the cyanotype is a memorial. War memorial. So, yan. Check na siya. Check, correct. Next is who was the fry, uh, first Prime Minister of the UK? Who was the first female pa ma? So, Marguerite Thatcher. Thatcher. Yan siya. The next one. Number 10. 10 na tayo. Who, who chairs the debates of the House of Commons? So, ano, sino daw nakaupo dun? <laughs> si ano, mali, the speakers, yan. Sino nag-ano sa kanila, mag-debate sila ba? Okay, yan. Number 11 na tayo. So, who was the captain of English football team won the won the so, si ano yan? Si Bobby Moore. Check natin. No, check natin. No? Yan. Next, number 12. When did the English defeat the Amada? Amada. Uh, defeat the Spanish Amada. 9, 15, no, correct. So, next, guys. Anyone can be complain about the police by writing. That's true. No. It's correct, yan. Yan, correct. Next, what is the minimum age required to serve, serve on a jury? You must... 18 years old. You're not 16. You cannot stand to be a jury. A jury. So, yan siya. How is the jury elected randomly from the electoral register? Yan. So, next. What is the bank holiday? A public holiday when the bank and many other businesses are closed for that day. So that's the answer. That's the bank holiday is. So next, what do you be given to vote before the general election take, take place? So, Full card. No sounds, darling, yet. Until I finish this, okay? Yes. Next. So, which is the following statements is correct? So, the solicitor charge are usually based on how much time the Spain spent, spent on case. Yeah. So, that's the... Ay, no sounds there. No sounds, please. I need to finish this plus uh, just five. Answer more. A question. By law, which two types of media have to give a balanced coverage of all, coverage of all political parties and equal time to rival viewpoints before an election so it is on the lawadaw radio and television so next yan basta pinakita ko na lang sa inyo malapit na tayo so which of the parliamentary service and count but not part of the UK dalit tayo uh, 
Yan, the Channel Island. Not part of UK. So next, Sir Frank, if, uh, Frank invent a jet engine. He is a doing a jet engine. Invented a jet engine. Like. Yeah, correct. The next, who wrote the Dapodil is a William Wordsworth. Siya ang nag, nag sulat. Next, <coughs> who was given the title of the Lord Protector? It's Winston Churchill. Churchill. No, 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 no. I'm, I was wrong. I was, I was wrong. Oliver Conwell. Oliver Conwell. Sorry, guys. So, what are the 40 days before Easter called Lent? Lent, that guys. Yan yung festival, yeah? Yan. So, dapat 24 to, nagkamari ako isa kasi alam ko yun yung answer. Yan. 23, yan yung result. So, answered correctly. So, congratulations, you pass. So, yan na yun siya, guys. Dito ang maganda. Tingnan mo, marami yung comments dito. At dito sila nagpapas ng exam. Yan, marami. Sabi nila, I did I also just did 1 to 16 with the citizenship test in this site. It's really helpful. Okay. Marami dito, guys. Marami. So, thank you, guys. I hope na nagmaging araw to sa inyo and I will see you next time if I pass the second attempt. So, Ito really helpful na site guys na dito kayo mag study. I'll study here every every day before my exam. Okay? Bye guys. See you next time. This is Inyong Inday the Lord Kitchen. Bye bye.